We are following some breaking news out of Fargo. Officials say the man accused of gunning down three police officers, one of which died, was planning on more mayhem. And Randy is standing by in our live center with the new details released just this afternoon in a press conference. Randy? Yeah, this stuff just coming in in the last hour or so. 23-year-old Jake Walline of St. Michael was shot last Friday on the scene of a traffic stop. Two other officers were hurt as well, including Egan native Tyler Hawes and Andrew Dotis. Just in the last hour, Fargo Mayor Tim Mahoney said the suspect in this case was planning even more mayhem in that community. 37-year-old Mohammed Barakat of Fargo had 1,800 rounds of ammo, multiple guns, and a grenade all in his vehicle. North Dakota's Attorney General Drew Wrigley said the attack was completely unprovoked, that the police officers were ambushed in a routine traffic accident. He says Barakat opened fire with a long rifle and was ordered 16 times to put that gun down and that the use of deadly force to kill Barakat was justified. Mohammed Barakat engaged in a savage attack. He engaged in unprovoked, completely unprovoked assault by firing a long rifle. He unleashed uh, what can only be described fairly as a murderous barrage of fire. But that isn't to say that it wasn't precise. In fact, it was. Well, the funeral for Officer Willeen is this Saturday in Pequot Lakes. A private burial will be held in Nisswa. Flags will fly at half-staff in Minnesota and North Dakota through sunset on Saturday. Kelsey BC, that's the latest from here. It's nine for the latest. Thanks, Randy.